Welcome back to TNA Impact here in Orlando, Florida. I'm curious to see how Allen Angels deals with this situation. The following contest is set for one fall. Introducing first, from Atlanta, Georgia, the frontman, Allen Angels. He's the frontman. He is also the host of TNA's newest show, Soundcheck, which debuted last week. Allen Angels' guest was none other than the standard of TNA. Josh Alexander and Alan Angel seemed destined to try and stir things up and instigate things with the walking weapon, saying, quote, you have to step on a few toes every once in a while to get to where you are, but you don't seem to have any problem doing that. Odd choice of words from Angels directed at TNA's world beater. Angels went on to say that, quote, I can think of a few names, one in particular, that you owe it to. What is Angels talking about? Your guess is as good as mine, but I appreciate Alan Angels asking the hard questions. Oh, oh and Angels attacking Alexander on his entrance. The bell is not yet rung. This match is not yet underway officially. Look, Angels pressing oh. the issues with the walking weapon and now pressing the attack on him as well. Oh, Alexander tossed back inside the ring by Angels. And the referee trying to gain control of this situation and back off Angels to check on Alexander. Checking in. Alexander looks looks like he's still ready to go, and there it is. There's the bell. Alexander said he could go, and Angels charges after the two-time TNA World Champion. Yeah, and maybe that was Angels' game all along. Take the shot, take the advantage. He knows Josh Alexander is too stubborn to quit. But Alan, look out! Might not be the time to celebrate. Oh, and Alexander turns Angels inside out. Listen, all that talk from Angels of Court, you've never really given him his acknowledgement. Listen, I, I heard a lot of jealousy in the voice of Alan Angels, regardless of the words he was saying. He looks at a person like Josh Alexander, who just beat Will freaking Osprey on this show within the last few weeks, and I think there's jealousy on the part of the front man. Oh, I mean, I think that's a bit presumptuous, Tom. I mean, Angels has a point. Yes, Josh oh. Alexander, look at him. He's incredible. He's beaten some of the best of the best. But you know, you know, and I know, nobody gets to the top, gets to these positions without making a few enemies along the way, without stepping on a few toes. That's just the nature of this business. Listen, Josh Alexander is not a, quote, politicker or a backstabber. He gets Hello. into the ring and he fights for everything that he wants, and he has earned every championship, every accolade that's been bestowed upon him. I'm not necessarily disagreeing with that, but maybe, maybe there's somebody oh. that Alexander didn't even realize that he had stepped on, that he had wronged. Oh. That happens to us all the time. Now look at Angels, Angels covering up. He's ticked off Alexander. Ooh. Oh, it goes behind the referee's back and goes to the eyes of Alexander. Alexander tossed to the outside. Angels on the move and a dive, and he wipes out Alexander. Takes the shot where he can get it, like it or not. And Angels here is taking advantage of the situation. Angels, there's the splash. Beautiful there. Is it enough, however? Oh, and a kick out there by Alexander. No one can doubt the resilience of the walking weapon. But Angels trying his best to push it to its limits here. Trying to hook Alexander. Was he thinking about a C4 spike there? Shoulders down. Maybe. Hold on, cover. Oh, now Alexander oh. goes to the ankle. Ankle lock, center of the ring. There's very little places to go here for Angels. Desperately reaching for those ropes. Oh, now Angels gets to the bottom rope. That'll break up the submission attempt. I'll break his ankle. Uh, Angels has ticked off oh, Alexander. And that, that's the man that maybe didn't or didn't hurt somebody on his way shoulders here. Shoulders down, shoulders down, and a kick out. Just said he was going to break the man's ankle. I think Angels served it. Oh, and a kick right to the face. Angels. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying to hook Alexander. Yeah. Yeah. 
Alexander just too strong, able to fight free. Big right hand, down goes Angels. Angels just crumbling there. Alexander, oh! A nasty backbreaker. Broken in half there by the walking weapon. And now setting up Angels here for the C4 spike. But look at the arms of Angels who are limping his side. Didn't go for the C4 spike. Go for the ankle. Look at the tenacity of Josh Alexander. Angels down to the walking weapon. Here's your winner. I mean, the tenaciousness of Alan Angels was, was on display. But do not piss off. Josh Alexander is the message here. Josh Alexander hurt Alan Angels tonight and left the front man in his wake. Angels trying to stir things up on soundcheck, and you reap what you sow. And that said, Tom, I, I still have questions about that. Clearly, Angels had an idea, had someone some people, I don't know who, in mind when he's brought that up to the walking up. Oh, oh, wait, what the hell? Oh, my God, what the? That's a fan. What the hell is that? Get, get, good God. A fan just burst into the impact zone and is assaulting Josh Alexander. Oh, Jesus. my God. What the hell? in the hell? That, yeah, I know who that is, Tom. That's Simon Gotch. What the hell is he doing here?